Now, a large aquarium at a hotel lobby in Berlin has shattered kind of dramatically. It actually injured two people and police say they're also dealing with what they call a massive amount of water and presumably a massive amount of dead fish. The Aquadom, which contained 1,500 tropical fish, was described as the largest freestanding cylindrical aquarium in the world. Jenny Hill is at the site in Berlin. Standing here, it's clear just how powerfully that water blasted through the reception area of the hotel. The doors of the hotel were completely blown out by the impact. You can probably just see them over my shoulder there. There's still some debris in front of those doors among the bits of metal and pot plants and so on. You can still make out even the kind of trolleys that hotels use to transport luggage. One man we met here said he'd come back to try and retrieve his car from the hotel garage. Now, he'd been asleep, he told us, on the fourth floor of the hotel when he was suddenly awoken by a loud bang and what he described as shaking. When he looked over the balcony into the uh, internal atrium, into the reception area, he saw water coursing through it. He and his girlfriend were later escorted from the hotel along with many other shocked guests by police who he noted had machine guns with them. Now the authorities say they don't know what caused that tank to burst but they are now telling us that they don't believe it to have been the result of a targeted attack. The mayor of Berlin has just turned up here to survey the damage for herself. She said it's like it was like a tsunami. She like many others here though have expressed relief that this happened when it did. An hour or so later had that tank exploded. That lobby, the street outside, will have been full of visitors, many of them children. Uh, Jenny Hill with that fishy story uh, from Berlin.